Hey everybody, I just got off work. I drove the, you know, 60 seconds or whatever to Hobby Lobby and I'm gonna go in and see what they got since yesterday. <laughs> and um, this is gonna be a silent video or maybe I'll do a voiceover, I don't know. But I am going to go and see what they got. And then when I get home, I'll show you what I got. <laughs> see you soon. All right. So here we are at Hobby Lobby. We're looking at some of the clearance yarn. Looking at the warm and cozy yarn. Look at that. A few colors available. And, um, let's see, what else, what else? Just starting here, going down the aisle. We are looking, oh, the soft and sleek, the soft and sleek. Boy, them, them shelves are bare. Isn't it funny people take all but one ball of yarn? <laughs> is that not annoying? <laughs> Yarntopia. Okay, Yarntopia is my favorite yarn. Was so hoping that I would find some on clearance, but nope. And we're looking at the Katarina yarn. That was just, I believe, 99 cents a skein. Absolutely beautiful yarn. I've got my fair share here at home of that type of yarn, so I didn't feel... Um, to buy any and look at that look at that there's a lot of blue um, and we're looking at the 44th Street yarn um, I think all the colorways on that were on clearance so soft I love that yarn so much absolutely and they didn't have um, any of the I love this yarn in the lightweight oh what is this um, ah, the stitch, the stitch 101. That is some very soft yarn. Um, I did want to get some, but being on a budget, I had to be particular. They had a few colors of that. Um, yeah, it's, oh, that one's ugly. <laughs> the 44th Street yarn. I got some of that on a previous day. Um, oh, yeah. See, them shelves are getting empty now. That is very soft yarn, the Stitch 101. They have almost a, a lot of those colors were on clearance. God, I think they might be getting rid of them. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, let's go down. It's looking, yeah, looks like some of, there was only two, one or two colorways of certain yarns, but here we are, the Go for Faux. Go for faux. A lot of those were more like 274, I think. The Lush Loft. That stuff's pretty soft. Um, and, uh, well, kind of soft, but kind of not soft. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> soft on the outside and, and firm on the inside. And there's some more of the fur yarn. Hey, if you can if you can crochet with that, more power to you. I've tried snuggle up yarn. That stuff's so soft. I call it teddy bear yarn. <laughs> and here are the gorgeous Hanks. Look at those. Absolutely beautiful. I did not get any more. I know I should have got that blue and yellow and then a solid yellow. But again, I was on a budget. I had already got myself some of the Hanks. Um, so we'll see. You know, if I have to come across some money, if I happen to come across some money, uh, I will probably go back and get a lot of those hanks. But they were, I believe, three seventy four per skein. But regularly, those hanks are fourteen ninety nine. So yeah, and they didn't. None of those minis were on clearance that you see under the hanks there. The cotton minis, cute box, but not on clearance. And so yeah, I'm just showing you some of the hanks. There's still a lot there though. Still a lot on clearance. That blue and yellow is really quite beautiful, actually. And look at those. All the hanks are beautiful. Look at that. Just have to show them. <laughs> oh, let's go to the other side of the aisle. Look at that urban chic. 
I, I can tell you when I got done, um, a lot of those weren't there. <laughs> sorry. Not sorry. Urban Chic is quite a beautiful yarn. Interesting colorway patterns. Absolutely beautiful. And some yarns I haven't even heard of. Not really so interested in trying though. So not concerned. Ah, uh, and here we are. Here we are with the yarn ID. Not sure what makes that different than the I love this yarn. It's a little more expensive. And that soft secret, that was the only soft secret I saw in clearance. Oh yes, just showing off the I love this yarn. Look at all the different beautiful colorways. Not Just a few colors were on clearance with the I love this yarn, but I did get some, which you'll see at the end of this video. Yes, just in search, just in search of them, them yellow or not yellow, orange and red stickers, whatever you want to call it, red stickers. Yeah, a lot of beautiful colors of the I love this yarn. Uh, I love, I do love the I love this yarn, yarn. <laughs> yeah, those disappeared. Those went right into my cart. That Coraline color, really beautiful. A dollar twenty four, a dollar twenty four a skein. Look at that. Yeah, that went off the shelf. None of the other coral type colors uh, were on clearance. I wish that sparkle one was. It is really pretty. And we got some orange. Got some orange. Now going into the red section. And the neutrals. All right. So you can see I, I did throw some yarn in my cart. <laughs> Oh yeah, found that, brought that home. There was three of those left. Aside from that, uh, there was one that had like kind of creams and tans mixed in, but there was only four total of those on the shelf. The rest were all gone. I got the, I left one, but it wasn't the same color weight. There I am, loving and feeling on the yarn Utopia again. I can't stop touching it. In fact, I made a video last year called I can't stop touching it <laughs> you should check it out if you if you like blasts from the past okay so I'm just looking at some of the other yarns here having to do a voiceover because of noise in the store they didn't have any of those yarn be cakes on clearance none of them heartbroken heartbroken oh so sad not to see any of those on clearance. They probably would have got, been gone by the time I got there anyway. I'm sure of it. All right, where are we? Where Are we, are we digressing? I think we're digressing. <laughs> I, I'm just trying to be thorough, that's all. I don't want to miss any of them red stickers and then have someone say, oh, you didn't show that in your video. <laughs> Oh, we are getting this store covered, let me tell you. Top to bottom, up and down. Yep, and there's that scrubby yarn. I'd never tried that before, so I did get one, one of those skeins just to check it out and see what it's like. Of course, I had to get the purple. You know I had to get the purple. <laughs> All right, what else, what else? Yeah. The Scrubology, the only color they had on clearance was a yellow. Uh, I did end up throwing that yellow in my cart, but then it jumped back out of my cart and it never came back. So that was the only one they had on clearance. Yeah, it went in, but later on it jumped out. You, you won't see that in my haul video or this video, the end of the video where I show everything I got. Uh, yeah. See, I went back to the Urban Chic, and a lot of that jumped in my cart and, and didn't come back out again. You know. Yes. And they were having a 30% off clearance at the same time. 30% off sale, not clearance. What am I thinking? 
a 30% off sale going on at the same time as a clearance sale. <laughs> Unfortunately, you didn't get 30% off the clearance yarn. <laughs> I know, too bad. Yeah, that went in my cart. So many different beautiful colors. I so had a hard time choosing, but I could not get all of it. Oh, there I am. Oh my god. No, I did get that last skein. Okay. <laughs> it's cool how they how they have those little samples hanging so you can see how it works up knitted they don't do crochet ones do they oh why am i back at this <laughs> oh yeah i wanted to i was like upset that that purple colorway was not on clearance of course isn't that isn't that how things work out and here we are at the cotton that's supposed to be like 57 cents a skein and you know what Check this out. There were, I only found two colorways that were actually on clearance. If you can believe that. Maybe they'll mark some of more of them down later on. But that mint color, there was only two skeins left of that. It was on clearance. And that blue. That was the last skein of that. So there was a total of three little skeins of the cotton yarn craft your secret that were on sale or on clearance on that entire rack all the rest were regular priced but maybe that will change next week i really like their cotton colorways honestly they're great for making bath poofs or as i call them buff puffs okay so there wasn't much of the baby yarn on clearance maybe a few colors but for how much is there and all the different colorways and brand and styles oh look that was someone actually looks like they kind of took it out of their cart after and decided not to get it so they stuck it on some other shelf and i took it and look at the bloom chunky there was only one colorway of the bloom chunky on clearance the rest was all regular price um that colorway I forgot what it was and I can't see it in the video <laughs> yeah not really so much for clearance uh, in the baby yarn section and where else where else? some of them are really pretty uh, there's one there's one that one colorway and that one colorway lots of dots that's that's a fun yarn I'm curious to know how that worked out, but again, I'm on a budget. I had to pick the yarns that were most important to me and not all the yarns that I wanted. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'd be selling my right arm. if. Look at that, the Pima Supreme. That is supremely soft. And I really wanted some of that so bad. Um, a lot of those I believe a lot of those colorways were on clearance. Just beautiful, very, very soft cotton yarn. Very soft. And they had a decent colorway sele color selection. So, and then they had that kind of boucle uh, yarn, cotton yarn, DK, cotton DK, or so, yeah, cotton DK. I think almost all of those colors were on clearance. Now, when you got all the colors on clearance, I'm thinking discontinued. Say goodbye forever. That's sad. Oh, and here we are with the sugar wheels. You can see a lot of them were not on clearance, but I did grab all of those. There was five of those and I grabbed them. And you will see that at the end of this video. You will see that and you can see none of the other colorways were clearanced and very sad because that purple and green so curious about that <laughs> so curious yep nothing else on clearance that is too bad that's too bad all right what else what else Law, this is going to be a long video, but you know, I never make videos like this. And here we are, and yep, I grabbed those. Those actually didn't belong there either. Again, someone 
put them in their cart and pull them out and put them on some random shelf like I did with some yard today. <laughs> so, you know, it happens. And there's some more of that, you know, teddy yarn for the teddy bear. I think that was three. I want to say that was 374, but I could be wrong. But I mean, you get the idea. It's extremely clearance and there was nothing over $4. So, and some greens. And I, for a minute there, when I was looking at the cotton, I'm like, I see no clearance. And I was looking at the Arabella and then I saw that. Yes, I did. And I'm like, oh wait, that's, I love this cotton. And I was looking at the colors. There actually is several colors of the cotton that are on clearance. That's the chunky cotton, by the way. That's the chunky cotton. I don't know what you do with that. I'm curious about it, though. It's kind of got the blue clay texture. Yeah, that's got sparkles. Took it. Mine. I own that now. <laughs> you are coming home with me. <laughs> Oh, let's see what else. Just showing off more of the yarn. Some, some of this, I just really don't have a whole lot to say about it. I really wanted that to be on clearance, but it was not. <laughs> That's on clearance, the white. Yeah, so they had several colors on clearance. Uh, definitely a variety. I think that was the light denim blue, maybe. Let's see, what else, what else, what else? If that, yeah, that was the light denim blue. And then I saw the mint and I said, you're coming with me too. And actually I was talking to somebody in the store who was really quite surprised to find Clarence. Like she was looking through the yarn and she didn't even notice the orange stickers till I said something. <laughs> It was so funny. I'm like, oh yeah. I, and I said, you know, this only comes once a year. I said, you know, I had an employee tell me last year that they have clearance yarn all the time. And this year I really looked out for it and didn't find it. There is the Arabella. There is the Cotton XL. That Arabella yarn is soft and it is, uh, as for knitting, it's very wonderful to work with. I have not tried to crochet with it yet. And they had some silky yarns. Hint of silk, yes. Such tiny skeins though. Like it's it's hint of silk and it's very, very soft. And you think I gotta make a wearable with this, but when you think about how many skeins you'd have to buy to make a wearable, yeah. So I just kind of passed that up, even though I really wanted it. Oh, I suppose I could have made like a shawl or something with it. And there's a cotton at Lynn, or however you say it. Yeah, a lot of beautiful yarns. The, all the sock yarns. Well, not all of them. I'm sorry. A good part of them. That was a pretty sock yarn. I should have got it, but limited budget. And I have some sock yarn, and I haven't made socks, so I have no business getting any more. And here we are. We're looking at more more yarn you know I have to constantly find something to say when you do the voiceover yep that went home with me the soft and sleek all the soft and sleek yarns are just absolutely I love them all definitely I would recommend any soft and sleek whether it's the regular or the chunky and those were the chunky and they went in my cart as you can see my cart is getting very full and the Chloe there was a couple colorways of the Chloe on sale. Now, I absolutely love the colors of the Chloe. There's a softness to it, but it's very wooly feeling. It has a strange texture to me. And uh, the texture kind of puts me off, but it is, it is really beautiful yarn. And I think normally it's like $5.99 or $6.99 for one of those little skeins. The Fireside, uh, it's... It's a beautiful yarn. There was a couple colorways that were on, on clearance with that. And what else? What else? 
in that colorway, whatever, whatever that is. I don't know. I think it's someone stuck a purple in front of it or a blue. Oh, and by the way, this yarn, where was it? Where was it? I feel like we just passed up a yarn that I wanted to tell you about. That's okay. Look at, there was a lot of chunky yarns that were not on clearance. A bit disappointing. Yeah, just looking. Just looking for more clearance. Oh, wait, am I still on the cottons? Oh, I'm looking at the other side. Okay, so I went up one aisle, one, si one side of the aisle and down the other, and here we are in the loopy yarns. So curious, are do you like the loopy yarns? As a crocheter, do you? And look at that. It's like roving style. Like, that is for people who spin. Yes. And there's a lot of it there. I would love to learn how to spin so I could buy that. The chunky knit. I wouldn't even know what to do with that. Let me know if you've ever made anything with something like that, the chunky knit. What do you do with it? There's my full cart. <laughs> Again, not much for a clearance on the baby yarns, but the baby yarns there are really quite beautiful. See, I think that was me dropping two of them skeins off the berry. <laughs> okay, what else? What else? Or maybe I just, no, I'm putting them in my cart. Silly me. I'm putting those in my cart. Those poor displaced yarns. <laughs> Thank you. Urban Chic, the berry colorway. And that's just other clearance that they have. You know, like books and fabrics and buttons and, and the like. And here we are being very thorough again. Again, showing off the Hanks. Because Hanks are beautiful, aren't they? Hand dyed hanks are beautiful and um, just can't get enough of those. Why? I just, probably because everybody loves hanks. That's why I show so much of them. And here we are with the, the fuzzy yarns. Oh, that romantique. Okay, so here was a thing. That purple was not in clearance. But that cedar colorway was on clearance. I had grabbed one more. And then there was a blue. That one. That blue. The, this, this cedar colorway, that brownish one, and that blue were the only romantique that were on clearance. All the rest, I think there was only four or five colors anyway. But there was only two colors that were on clearance. The blue is kind of pretty, but I wasn't like in love with it, so... And here we are. Those were not on clearance, but they're pretty. And there we are showing those again. And here's where things are going to get kind of boring because I'm just going through and being really thorough, making sure I didn't miss anything that I wanted to show you so that you can see everything that was on clearance. They didn't have any of that scrubology on clearance yet. It's always yet at this point, isn't it? Because... You know, it takes so much time to clearance off stuff and. Oh yeah, they need to clearance all of that. <laughs> we need more. I love this yarn clearance, especially on those purples. Oh yeah, baby. I use those for my blanket that I made for my bed. And look at that. They need to put so many more colors on clearance. Absolutely. Let's see what else, what else. And here I am showing that yarn ID again. Just being a little more thorough with it. I don't know. That it was the only color of the yarn ID as of that day, today, <laughs> that was on clearance. And there we are with that. Breathe deep. Oh, Gosh, what's the name of the yarn that's similar to? I can't think of it off the top of my head, but very nice soft yarn. What else? What else? What have we? Oh, just another 
There was only two colors of the Breathe Deep that were on clearance. Oh, maybe not. I think they had a few colors. I see that now, the charcoal gray. And let's see what else. And we have this. Comfort something. Why am I not showing this in the video? <sighs> and here is showing more of the Urban Chic. And what's left after I took what I wanted. Wasn't really fond of the gray and mustard. Um, or maybe I'm just coming back. Okay, so what I did was I'm coming back to grab more. Or maybe not. I think I already grabbed it. All right, again, being very thorough, being very thorough. And that's like kind of a four weight velvet yarn. And what else, what else? Going back to the 44th Street, the yarn Topia, again, making a small visit. And here's the thing, the Wrapology. Not a single one of those colors were on clearance. I'm hoping maybe next week. You never know. They might be done putting stickers on stuff. Or they might not. But we will be checking it all out. But none of the Wrapology was on clearance. And that was a big disappointment. I think they had like a couple colors last year. That orange and yellow. It's like sun fire. I love it. But I am there to clearance shop, not 30% off shop. So it did not end up in my cart. Ah, uh, the soft and sleek low pill fiber. I'm pointing at it because I'm telling you guys, you got to buy. That's, I highly recommend the soft and sleek. It is very soft. It is very sleek. It is low pill fiber and it is so worth it. I survived. I made it out of the store. Look at that bug. <laughs> Let me flip my camera around. There we go. That's where it belongs. Look. Look. Oh yeah. We're gonna go through it when I get home. <laughs> so Hello, everyone. I'm back. I'm back home. <laughs> and I am ready to show you what I got at Hobby Lobby today. Thank you to my boss for donating money for my baby blankets to give to Waypoint. Now, if you don't know, Waypoint is an organization in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. Um, they do a lot to help people, help families, help women. Um, help with housing, they uh, help, they assist people who are fleeing domestic violence, they have um, like groups and they have childcare and they have housing services. They are just, the, just an all around great community organization that helps people get established, find stability and um, yeah, so uh, it is so, so close to my heart, and I love this place so much. They were so nice to me when I needed uh, some of their services, and they bent over backwards to help me, and I just, I cannot be grateful enough, and so I have a very strong loyalty for Waypoint, and um my boss donated money uh, so I can make baby blankets. Now, some of this will not go to baby blankets, but I do have yarn that I can substitute it for. Um, and uh, from my personal stash. And um, I will be making more baby blankets than then she donated, <laughs> put it that way. She's definitely going to get her money's worth. Um, anyway, so on to my haul. Oh, I'm so excited. So, let me show you. 
Um, there was more on Clarence today than there was yesterday. So today is June, Saturday, June 11th. Um, and I went yesterday, Friday. They had uh, a few things, but not a lot. But today they had a lot more uh, of them orange stickers floating around and I was really excited. So the first thing I got, um, I was really curious about and um, never used this before. <laughs> I mean, sugar and cream cotton is not is not something I'm unfamiliar with. I am very familiar with you know, kitchen cotton and different brands, but I wanted to try this scrub off yarn. And it's got like regular cotton and this scrubby stuff all like mixed in, all blended together. You know, I kind of, I like to take the scrubby cotton, like the Yarn Bee brand, the Hobby Lobby brand, and mix it with regular cotton and make like face scrubbies and stuff. So this is basically what I do all in one little ball. So I think I'm going to love this stuff. Um, anyway, it's the Sugar and Cream Scrub Off. It's a four weight. It was a dollar twenty-four regularly, four ninety-nine, and I got the colorway, pretty purple. So that's what that looks like. I got one of these because I just wanted to try it, and then I got some of these yarn bee sweet minis. I got three of them in the colorway catching sapphire, and I thought. This would make such a lovely shawl. So, um, like I am not just making baby blankets, okay? I can make, you can donate pretty much anything. You know, anything that could be useful for somebody, um, you can donate. But I thought Catching Sapphire, it's a very dark blue and then a, a medium blue and then a gray. And this is the colorway for that. Regularly $4.29 and I got it for $1.07. And I got three of them. So hopefully, oh, maybe I can make like a little boy, little boy outfits or whatever. A little boy outfit, a newborn baby outfit with this. They're beautiful colors. So yeah. Um, oh, like a little, what is that? Like a layout set where it's got like the little sweater and the little hat. Maybe I can do that with these. I got three of those. And then I got some of this. I love this yarn. Now this wasn't with the, I love this yarn. It's like someone put it in their cart and then went to the next aisle and these, I, meh. I don't think I want to get this after all. Um, it does not have much yardage. It only has 196 yards, but looks like kind of a gradient or something. Yeah, pale aqua gradient. And I got three of these. And I think this would make a really nice like little car seat blanket. And that's what the color looks like. That's pretty. And the I Love This Yarns are $1.24. I got three of those. And then I got three of this colorway, the, the, the Stone Wash. I Love This Yarn Stone Wash, 252 yards in the color Coraline. And um, that's what, I got three of these. And that's what that looks like, $1.24. Yes, yes. And then I got the I Love This Yarn print in the color Belladonna. And I just got done Man Overboard. <laughs> Overboard, someone get out the lifesaver. Um, I got, this is the color Belladonna. I just got done watching Amber's little haul that she video she posted today. 
think she got the same color. Thank you for saving me some, Amber. This is so pretty. It's got the yellows and the pinks and the gray and the white. I found three of these. I took the last three of these. It's fine. That's so pretty. Look at that. I got three of those. What else? Ah, oh, yes. Cotton. They had their cotton on clearance. 94 cents. And I'm not talking about like the kitchen cotton, okay? You know what? The kitchen cotton at the end of the aisle, um, they only had two colors on clearance. One of them was mint. The other one was like this dark blue color. But there was only two mint and one blue. And three little skeins of the kitchen cotton. Um, and none of the other ones were clearance. But they did have the I love this cotton clearance. And no purples. Only specific select colors. But they had the aqua sparkle. And I got five of these. Look at that. It's so pretty. <laughs> So pretty. Aqua Sparkle, 94 cents. Oh yeah, you can really see the sparkle now. That's so beautiful. I had to get it. And then I got four skeins. I got five skeins of this, okay? And I got four skeins of the I Love This Cotton, just regular, not sparkle, in the color mint. So that is a minty color. I don't know. The aqua is just a tad darker, but um, wouldn't those be cute together? I don't know. You know, I can make baby dresses. I can make little baby dresses with this. It's a nice neutral color, boy or girl, right? Yeah. And then, okay, so this is one I am keeping. I'm going to switch this out. Um, cause I really love this, but they had, uh, one color way of the sugar, way, sugar wheel cotton. Mm -hmm. And this stuff is really soft, very soft cotton. Um, I did do make a video, me going through the aisles, uh, with my phone, my making a video of all the clearance that we have here so far, <laughs> so far. Okay. There's more to come. I believe that there's going to be more to come. So I am just on top of that. Okay. Next week. This upcoming week. This upcoming week. Yeah. I might have to go. Have. <sighs> I want the yarn topia. There wasn't any yarn topia on Clarence yet. I really want that so bad. <laughs> Please. Let that be a Clarence item next week. Anyway, I got the Sugar Wheel Cotton in the color Lucia Lagoon. The Lucia Lagoon. Okay, these were $1.49 a piece. And this is the colorway. This is the colorway. And I got, I got five. I got the last five of these. Unless they got some stock in the back somewhere and they can refill that shelf, I got the last five. That's right. I got the last five. I got greedy with this. I've been, I've been really behaved. Like, if you go back a year and you see the haul that I had last year, oh my God. I literally had two shopping carts mounded, okay? It was, there was a mound, okay? It wasn't, um, at the level, okay, it was mounded. Oh my God, I went crazy. Last year was better in some ways, but I went crazy. It was, I was unstoppable. I was greedy. I would do it again if I had the same amount of money. <laughs> No shame in my yarn game, okay? I got five of those. And then, I was nice. I left some of this behind. But I got me some Urban Chic. And I want your opinion. Tell me if this Urban Chic is good for blankets. 
because I thought maybe it might be good for blankets. If it's not really blanket material, like baby blanket material, then I'll switch it out for some yarn I bought, like the, oh, what are they called? The cakes. I got some cakes, some premier cakes. Um, I can't think of the name of them right now. I put myself on the spot. Now I left myself speechless. What the heck? Okay, so you let me tell me if these are like, no, I wouldn't use that for a blankie blanket because I've literally never used the Urban Chic before. But they're normally $5.49 a piece, and I got them for $1.37. I know, right? They are so beautiful. I've been wanting to try this yarn. But I always pass it up. I don't know why. So it's a three-weight yarn, 275 yards. It's acrylic and cotton blend. I didn't realize it was a blend. But anyway, so I got three of the colorway hydrangea. So that's super pretty. That's what that looks like. Hi, Dranja. I got three. And then I got three of the colorway mint. Mint. This is really pretty too. You can see like some orange and yellow mixed in there. I got three of these. Then I got three of the colorway berry. I'm sorry, this kind of reminds me of blood. It's probably just me, okay? It's probably just me. I mean, I can see the berry, but I saw them and I'm like, those look so bloody. <laughs> like, <laughs> but it's a color berry. It's a colorway berry. And there's a little bit of blue in there and I'm like, that's just, that, that's just what the blood looks like before it's hit oxygen. That's, <laughs> I can't stop, look. Okay, so I, I can't stop thinking about blood when I look at this. So I don't know, I don't know if I can make this into a baby blanket. Someone told me they make shawls with them. I don't know, but you but you tell me, would you, would you turn this bloody color away into a baby blanket? <laughs> You know, like maybe a little car seat blanket. <sighs> I got three. Okay. Then I got was it six. Maybe it was eight. Let me double count again. Yes. All right, this one, uh, you'll know why, but this is one that I'm I'm gonna keep. And it is the colorway Juneberry Breeze. I got six of them, but look at them, look at the purple in there. Um, it's not at all like blood, unless you know, you, you see a, um, a mulberry that's been slaughtered on the side of the sidewalk and this this might resemble that but I don't think so purple mulberry blood I don't know what is my blood kick this is sounding really gross and uncomfortable okay it's you know what it's the berry it's the berry the bloody berry urban chic so June Berry Breeze. So I got six of these. This is one I'm keeping. So what was the ones I was keeping? Oh yeah. You know what? This sugar roll cotton goes a long way. I might be able to make like a little baby blanket and keep some for myself. You know, I made a summer top with this. I had five five cakes of the zesty zesty something colorway it's pink and yellows and I made a um, oh I made my zesty top with it and I only use like two and a half cakes and I'm a 2x 
Yeah, so. But anyway, yeah. So that is all the yarn. Oh, wait, no, no, I'm sorry. I missed one. Oh, rude. <laughs> okay, so then I also got, did I say the Urban Chic is at work? They were a dollar thirty-seven regularly, five forty-nine. So then I got four balls, four skeins. Why do I keep saying balls? I've been watching a lot of Korean romance shows so maybe they're getting in my head skeins okay skeins um, of the soft and sleek chunky it's a low pill fiber now I love the soft and sleek yarns they're soft they are very soft they're very nice they are low pill and they have decent yardage and I got the soft pink color 100% low pill acrylic, and they have 211 yards per skein. Yeah, so that's that color. It is soft pink. It's very nice pink, very girly pink. Yes. So, that is all. Okay, that is all the yarn I got now. I haven't missed anything. Oh, these sweet minis. They are so pretty. Look at that. A dollar seven I paid for these. Look at that color. Okay. No recaps. We don't need recaps. You can you can watch this video again if you need to. Anyway, so that's the yarn I got from Hobby Lobby today, June eleventh, two thousand twenty two. I can't wait to see what the next week brings. If anything, if there's anything you know what'll be left? Everything that didn't have a, a red sticker this week. <laughs> Let's cross our fingers for the Yarntopia, okay? Oh my god, they had Touch of Silk. They had Et Lynn. They had some others on clearance. I honestly, there was other ones I wanted to get that I haven't tried yet. Like the Touch of Silk and some other ones. You'll, you'll see it. But, um, you know... This girl's not rich. I do need to buy a lottery ticket though. Someone said that in my comments. I said, you know, I need, you should go out and buy a lottery ticket. And I'm like, yeah, and then I should win the lottery. I feel that. So. It's impossible to win the lottery. <laughs> my daughter just said, it's impossible to win the lottery. But people do win the lottery. So how do you explain that? true you're very smart all right anyway that's enough this is going to be kind of a long video anyway so i am going to let you go i hope you made it if you made it till the end of this video give me a purple heart okay a purple heart for um domestic fight domestic violence survivors DV survivors and a heart, a purple heart for the purple yarnivore. There we go. See how many purple hearts I have at the end of this in my comment section. Ha! Huh. We'll see who's been watching my videos. <laughs> Do you feel trapped? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I gotta go. You guys take care. Be safe. Do random acts of kindness or not so random, but do acts of kindness. <laughs> show compassion and be understanding and show mercy to people and do it for the sake of humanity. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.